Hey, uh, folks, Quilly King here, and welcome to an episode of Let's Play Baldur's Gate Insanely Evil Edition. We're at Firewind Bridge. Last episode, we uh, we did take on a uh, Ogre Mage and got absolutely obliterated by a lightning bolt. So let's see if we can do better this time. Let's pre-buff first of all. Not that any of the defenses we just popped are going to help with the lightning bolt. We do have, uh, we have like one or two maybe potions of absorption, but mostly we're going to have to brute force this one. We can't reuse spells to get through this as far as I know. Um, what? No, no, no. That's so not what I want to do. Okay, let's try that again. I was just like, we don't, we know what the dialogue is. I don't have to click on things. Beat Apparently right. I picked on the option that does not get us the cool fight. What's wrong? You see the jar. Give us the jar, give us the jar, taking the jar. <laughs> so yeah, he'll, he'll... I guess we can let him talk this time. I'm free mortals, before you die, I know you blah, 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 blah. Okay. Speak. You're very, you're very terrifying, buddy. Um, oh yeah, I didn't prep for, um, for my magic arrows. I will listen for now. What despair do for us? It reduces his AC? Okay, that's actually probably worthwhile here. I wonder if I can somehow reduce the chance that we get... Again, you disturb death. me. I guess my squishies, I'll just take you out of, like, Jacques. the arc. You're so dull. That is maybe most likely. Oh, you are so here. irritating. I'm expecting he's going to lighten about the people in front of him. What is it this time? Here comes the spell cast. Oh yeah. At least this way you can only hit one. The problem is if you hit the people with low uh, hit points, they're just going to die. Or not. I guess Eldolf made a save, so that's good. I wonder if I can want to frost this guy. Mm, probably too high. Night Singer, give me power. <laughs> pause. Okay, yeah, let's just, we ran out of stack. You know what? Let's use arrows of burden fighting on this guy. Oh, come on! I'll have to find another group to keep up. I don't want to talk. This isn't worth I mean, I suppose I could choose not to do Did you really have a morale break? Holy cow. Hmm. We could just choose not what to do Kark. Yeah, out of cure. Maybe I'm wrong. Let's have Edwin Magic Missile him. Yeah, no, he is not taking any damage from that. Oh, I never did go and memorize his third level stuff. I wonder if I could use Dispel Magic to strip this. I don't think so. Well, maybe, let's find out. First of all, I should definitely have some shit memorized in here. I didn't realize we never got around to adding his level three memorizations. There's some funky shit we can do to skull crap in some places. So it's basically a fireball spell that you set up as a trap. I don't think he can be hit with miscast magic while he's got the minor globe of invulnerability around him. I wonder if we can silence him. It's a sphere. You know, maybe. Be direct. Um. Wrong spell. Speak and be gone. If I can't cast spells, maybe the answer is don't let him cast spells either. I will listen. Oh, now. did I remember to do the arrows? I did not. Assuming they even function. Okay, well, we're gonna go to arrows of biting immediately. For this. Be direct. Okay. Uh, what's wrong? We see the jar. Give us the jar. Give us the jar. Give us the jar. Okay. Jean Calais. 
silence this area. <laughs> Check. Kark silent spell ineffective. The orb really protect you from being silenced? Again you disturb me. Night Singer, give me power. Huh. You are so irritating. Lightning through there, that's fine. Actually, if if you have his attention, we might portion a portion of fortitude. Oh, I was about to say, hold on. Kagan Eldoth is in a bad spot here. Okay, well we know silence doesn't help. How may I be of assistance? Again, you disturb dull me. Class. You're so dull. Be direct. Let's just surround him. And then... <laughs> maybe that can prevent chaining. You are so Yeah, it's just irritating. Edwin. <laughs> Alright. We Speech gotta move a little bit around here. What's your worry? Because otherwise, we still get a little bit of stacking. What is it now? It can't just on the sky. I mean, if he just decides to target Eldoth, he's just dead. All right, I think we're not going to do Kark right now. That's a damn shame. Uh, well, before we consider, how many potions of absorption do we have? Maybe we can go in with a partial party. Well, okay, let's consider this. I would assume that Dorn is our biggest melee damage dealer. Speak, I will listen for yeah, now. 12 to 21, 11 Thacko, that's really good. What about Quill? 10 Thacko. Okay, Quill's our other best melee. If we just absorption these two and just send them in solo, let's see what happens. This will be our last little uh, attempt at shenanigans. If it doesn't work out, then we'll just call it um, be direct. No good over here. Okay, one more save. Speak and be gone. How may I be of assistance? Send you two forward. You guys just chill way over here. What's wrong? What's wrong? Jar, jar, jar. There we go. I will listen. Absorption. What is it this time? Absorption. Be direct. My portion of fortitude too. It's because we're not going to be having heals. Go pester someone else. Yes. Speak and Looks like gone. he's going to target Quill, which is fine. Keep the lightning bolt away from the other pack that's sitting there. Do debuff his AC. If that even works. Hopefully it does. Poison weapon. Again, I'm not sure. Okay, there we go. See, no lightning bolt damage. Close is immune to my damage. Gonna keep doing it because we're not running sword close stratagems. Alright, roll some hits. Don't attack roll hit, but he still says uninjured. Oh, because of his magic mirror. Er, oh, yeah. How may I be of assistance? I wonder how many lightning bolt spells he's got. He's no longer lightning bolting. Maybe he's only got a couple. Maybe we've hit his predefined kill limit. What is it this time? I will listen. Four and kill. Night singer. Laconia. Let's see about getting a heal. I'm going to queue up another potion of healing here for Quill. Because we are being meleeed. Alright. Alright, no. I think... What the... Okay. I... Com Apparently if you just keep hitting escape, the game just quits. When you, like, open the wrong menu, 
The game's like, surely you want to exit, right? Peter no, Rick, no, that's not what I want. Speak and be gone. We're gonna send in just Dorn to soak the lightning bolt hits. We're gonna let him lightning bolt twice, and then we're gonna send in everyone else. Make sure you're out of like aggro radius. Here. What is it this time? So Speak he's gonna lightning bolt Dorn. There we go. Do this actually. Yes. One. That's two. Okay, we think that's all he's got. Kick his ass. You're using your magic things. You're taking acid damage. All right. Oh, that's Dorn. Taking acid damage. Never mind. I'm just gonna try to pay attention to the combat log a little bit here. Park kicks 20 slash damage from Dorn. That's good. Uh, we're being hit with magic arrow or acid arrow. Can hurt a fair bit. Okay, Viconia. Drop the heal. What the hell was that? Is that magic missile hitting for freak? Oh my god. The double damage. Alright. F this guy. F this guy. But uh, no, we got it now. Because now he can't freaking uh, lightning bolt us. And that's the only thing that can kill us, right? Surely he can't use magic missile to kill, like, the tankiest tank that ever tanked and. You must tank gather them. your party before venturing yeah. forth. Apparently he can. So, you know. Do, 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 do. Okay. Uh, there's a shit ton of traps in this. And a lot of respawning bits, if I recall. Cobalt Commandos. Mother, you're fine. So bitter that there's someone we weren't able to defeat. You're so dumb. I don't trust this. I feel system. like there's definitely a trap over here. Seriously? Oh, there it is. Uh, oh yeah, I'm gonna have to do the armor shuffling thing. Also, my party's not in the order that I was expecting. Um, oh. Speak and be gone. Does someone want to go that way? Uh, just needed to highlight something that felt very trap like over there. What is it this time? Go back, Will. Oh my god! Let's block here. Okay, this is definitely going to be a place where um, we are going to need maximum ranged attacks be of because we will bottleneck otherwise. Again, okay, everyone's set on that. That's good. Let's try to reorganize ourselves so the tanks are up front. But yeah, these narrow hallways suck. Oh, uh, that is quite the group of mobs. Okay. Speak and be gone. What is it this time? Go go sleep spell. Jeez. Well, you're still using your poison arrows, which are probably unnecessary right now. Don't bore me. Make me some more of those. I will listen. Okay. For now. Why do I feel like super under leveled all of a sudden, you know? We're feeling so good, so strong, so powerful. And now it feels like everything wants to murder us hardcore. Even Kobolds! Admittedly, Kobold commandos are always super mega dangerous. Beat erect. Are you saying something about being erect? How may I be of assistance? Again, you disturb me. What's your worry? Grab, 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 grab. Speak. We're gonna have no shortage gone. of fire hours after this. 
Especially since I think these things all respawn too if you want to wander back and forth, but I couldn't imagine. I will listen for now. After this, I think we're definitely going to go into Cloakwood and just try to push the main quest. Because F the rest of this stuff. Do, 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 do. What's my timer at? Okay, 15 minutes. Good. Oh, I think right over here. This is where the Death Knight? No, not Death Knight. Um, Ultra Mage. Oh! Who the hell are you? Oh, what I was expecting. Um, so try to interrupt that spell real quick. Night singer, give Knock you down, maybe? What is it this time? Sleep would be good. Did you just go invisible? Or'd you die? You're getting XP from something. Oh, improved invisibility. Um, Now I'm really annoyed that I didn't uh, get also? fairy dust. I was not expecting this kind of BS. Um, I'm going to just pull back a bunch here. He wants to chase us? Fine. I Cannot fall. Oh, see, we got respawning Cobalt Commands behind us. Did we just get lightning bolted through this whole area? Okay, that is incredibly unfriendly. I can't respawn anyway. Oh, we can drop the silence spell. You know what? Let's be cheesy and preemptively drop it. Um, okay. You walked really far forward for that. I guess I gave it a little bit of an angle thing. There you go. See, Lendorn has been si No, Viconia. I specifically want you to move backwards. Speak and be gone. If these guys had more than three brain cells, they might be able to work out how to path around things. Okay, so let's obliterate you before you cast freaking lightning bolt. Okay, I'm not bitter. You are so irritating. Help! I am so dumb. I will listen. Start giving everything. What's your worry? And that's basically the situation. Either things are going to explode in one hit from us, or we're going to explode in one hit from them. Color spray, ghoul touch. Fireball's always got some interesting potential. Direct. Night singer, give Don't me power. Fall. Speak and be gone. You're so uh, where's dull. Where's this stuff? Oh, over here. Dun, 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 dun. I okay. For I now. suspect there's going to be very little chance we get through this without being molested, and that is indeed the case. What's your way? Held off. Just sidestep over here now. Thanks. Oh no, and we triggered the Ogre Mage at the same time? That's not what I wanted. Um, your minions don't bother Gullikin no more. Yeah, because we totally uh, did this in the right order to understand the context of that particular message. Let's see if we can hit him with something real quick. I suspect most of this is going to work. I think the Ogre Mages have innate magic resistance and everything. Come back around here and monster summoning right there. Oh, he got knocked down. That's great. Keep hammering away at that guy. Because if he decides to lightning bolt down this hallway, we're all dead. Dorn? Oh! Confused. It's going to be annoying. Oh, we got a few people confused. Let's drop our own fear here. I'm hoping that's friend, like friendly fire... Uh, where's the Ogre Mage? Did he go invisible? Oh, he died! Excellent! Okay, well then, you don't have to badger Nixon over there. Instead, just try to sleep some kobolds. Holy cow. Now, with our confused people, they might decide to attack us. We're just going to sort of walk away. They have a random, like, oh, we might get more freaking kobolds over here. Wait here. Direct. Oh, there's still some dudes. Speak and be gone. Okay, we're no longer confused, which is good. So Eldoth is still over here and he's probably just gonna die and we'll have to like reload. I wouldn't at this point. I'd be like, you know what? 
for We'll res you, or maybe we won't. I don't know. Ha! Huh. Quick save. I was terrified there. I was sure we were about to... Be direct. What did we just see? Oh, Cobalt Commando. Probably respawn. This is targeting our summoned creatures. That was kind of friendly of it. Okay. Let's just move part of the group at a time here. One of the things you can do to avoid respawns in areas like these is you can leave um, units parked in strategic places, including summons. Because as long as you have vision over an area, then um, shit won't respawn. So, very powerful. We're going to have to figure out what we're doing spell-wise soon. Okay. We had been trying to rest. When we go oh, there's stairs right here. Let's go somewhere safe. Are we being attacked again? I'm just gonna go up the stairs. Hey, Junko. Oh, you're a halfling. Yes, you're in Gully Kin or whatever. What in the night hills are you doing in my borough home? Don't know why you're here. Any assumption I might have about halfling hospitality does not apply to me. When a traitor breaks in my home, I kill him. Um. You kill us. Don't make us laugh, Shorty. I will listen. The whole for the store now. smells like cobalt in here. I wonder if he actually was working with the Ogre Mage. Well, he's not anymore. Whatever might have been the case. How may I be of assistance? Oh, I'm still not wearing armor. Jeez. I was gonna say, I'm not going to be able to pick the lock. All right, it's okay. So we, we got knock spells for. Again, you disturb. Well, knock spell singular. There is no evil but stupidity. Um, books. And that's just, yeah, that's the secret door that leads back downstairs, right? Yeah, okay. We now open it from this side, but yeah. All right. You rest in this home. No, I'm not allowed to do that. All right, let's leave this home. There we go. Take the gold. Why not? Um, oh God. the pathfinding. There is no good or evil, only the charming and the teeth. Speak and be gone. All right, welcome to Gullican. Can I rest here? Cool, good, excellent. Only shallow. Make some arrows for me. Judge by I will listen for now. Let's buff up. Although I don't think there's any fights in the middle of all this. Yeah. Uh, Gullican Village. I'm assuming there's someone who, like, presents the problem to us, and then we can turn it in for a reward. Check these houses. I said, check these houses. Thank you. Really? What about downstairs? No, nope. generic halfling man. Well, I'm not gonna loot all the random containers in these people's houses. And I'm gonna be evil, but not petty. be somewhere in here that like here let's talk to this halfling man I a... wish I had my old tobacco Delilia the provider gives us what we need care for anything else uh huh hmm oh there we go there's a named person hey what's up well met traveler Gandalf well, received news. You've cleared out the Firewine Bridge. Where oh, that was quick. No longer will Cobots plague our tiny village. Must congratulate you. Job well done. Everyone's grateful. Take a small amount of money. Really? No rep? 250 gold, no rep. Now, there was some more stuff down in the ruins. I just don't know how much I care about going down there. Um, Undead Knight, Ghost Knight looks like was still in there. Ghost Knight is its own subquest, too, for something. Do I care? Well, we can always come back later when I decide to get my ren my vengeance out on um, on Kark. Maybe we'll go and take another look at the uh, the Firewine ruins. I don't know if there's anything else in this zone. It's near here that um, Nira's personal quest comes, right? I think there's a zone to the east of this that is Nira's personal quest. I suspect that 
I, first of all, I don't know if that's correct, and I suspect we can't access it without her. Without her having, like, fed us the quest. Oh, hello. Finally meet. Poor little Quill. Assume you're completely clueless as why you must die. Uh-huh. Incompetent bounty hunters. Listen, just, um... Yeah, you'll be as much trouble as this rabble we've killed. Okay, um... You have the look of a cleric about you. So we're going to target you first. You are so irritating. Night Singer, give me Yeah, we just want power. you to not cast some spells at us. Oh, and I got more in back here. Um, the sleep did not affect anyone. I might try again. It's possible everyone just got lucky what and made their save. Now? Or, you know what? Let's drop a horror here because... What's the mechanic on the horror? I don't think it's got any hit point things or anything like that. Or, uh, hit dice stuff. Yeah. Maybe I should just be using that at this point instead of sleep. Just load up on magic missiles instead. Oh, there we go. Great. Let's focus on the caster here. You're gonna still be annoying with all the running around, but and and on top of that, magic missiles. But yeah. Disabling spells are OP. I should probably be spamming them a lot more often. <laughs> we need someone to boost the speed. Where did we get those? The paws of the cheetah or whatever. I don't remember. I think in Baldur's Gate proper. Um, oh, they're trying to go where this person was pathing to, I think. I guess I could just magic missile you. Right. Horror probably fell off of the others as well. I don't know if they path back to where they were, though. I think they're doing melee stuff. Let's do range things. For now. Uh, hello, level up. The first duty in life is to be as artificial as Be direct. Dun, dun. I'm pretty sure there You're was still someone. So Chainmail unidentified. Okay, plus one longsword. Plus one Morningstar. Protect Illusion, Sleep, Color Spray, Potion of Heroism. Mail of the Dead. That's pretty good armor. There you go. An extra AC over here for our bard. Speak and be gone. But yeah, I kind of feel like there was still another runner. I guess they don't leech back to where they were. Hmm, Warg. One, two, three. Oh, thank you for recentering. Four. Right? One, two, three, four. Well, no, I'm not sure. Okay, fine. Change any stacks. So, while well, we're fighting, Baconia, you want to level up? Three spells, level three. We want to pack one remove paralysis. Now, nah, just get another cure meeting. I will listen for now. Well, I don't know. Hopefully, that was that. Oh, where's this path lead? Probably back into Gullican. Some skeletons, apparently. Okay. I'd say not terribly threatening. Yeah, except every now and again they just hit us with a billion range attacks and we have a really bad day. But today is not that day. Oh. Maybe I should kill the last one. And our bows and things like that do shit damage against them, too. That's one of the other nice things, though, about um, if you do do sling stuff. How come I can't... There you go. If you do sling stuff, um, they're bludgeoning attacks, so they do pretty good against skeletons in this early game when you might have... Well, this is not the early game anymore, but in the early game when you might otherwise have issues. So I think this just wraps around, but I'll just go and open up for pathing later. Well, later. I don't think I'm ever coming back to Gullican. But... Uh, 
uh, and yet that doesn't connect to the edge of the screen, so... No, I'd say that's it. But yeah, I think Nero's quest thing is somewhere over here, but I think um, Speak you can't travel gone. directly without her, and then you just get directions. So you can just travel there immediately without exposing it, because there's no way to expose it. I will listen for now. What's your worry? Be direct. Don't bore. Speak and be gone. All right. Cloakwood? Yeah. Screw this. Cloakwood. I will listen oh, I can now. probably follow up. Hold on. In Baragost here? You have been waylaid by enemies. Okay. And waylaid by wars. You're so dull. You're supposed to be all blurred, man. Why aren't you blurrier? Be direct. Okay. Um, but yeah, the uh, we gave him the the green goop that was rotting the iron. I guess. Can I sell him the bandit scalps? I know we can sell them in Nashkel. I can make whatever. There you go. You Find a way to counteract the contaminant. Lovely. And yeah, you've got better loot. He says. I don't know if that actually adds more items to this or not. Sell that. Yeah, you don't buy the scalps. I don't think... Yeah, I don't think there's any reason to keep this short sword. You can see, I think we're getting a lower price than this long sword here. So I might not bother selling it there. Oh, no value for that. Oh, okay. Purely cursed item. The same thing here, although it's only worth, I think, 150 as a base. So I don't mind as much. Speak and be gone. I think. Were you carrying with a long sword? Yeah, there you go. I so we'll be able to sell them simultaneously and not lose cash. We shall hold here. You look tired. Okay, so we just sped through the cloak woods before, um, and we might want to go and look at a full clear of things. Uh, oh yeah, we need to rest because our character's going to be lost here. What's your worry? Be direct. Good. Okay. Don't bore. Poison arrows. Speak and be gone. Good. And... I do not understand this mouse magic. We'll at least get a shield spell going on. All right. So, this zone... We have to make friends with a rich guy who will help us out in a little Be bit, once we get to Baldur's Gate. Speak and be gone. And then we get to kill some druids. I mean, I guess we can do a talk down, but it's not gonna happen. Hey, all this censure, you Sension, Sension star. Um, kind of, yeah, of course we'll help you. You look rich and we could use some rich friends to fund our political campaign. Sure, the plan to attack a cottage, we best be prepared. Yep, mm-hmm. So it's conflict between some hunters and some druids. Now these are I like druids no of the shadow circle or whatever. They're like eco-terrorist druids. Yeah, um, no, we're gonna be bitch heart. Seniad, there's uh, some fun voice here too if you've got uh, Jahira still in your party. Can't let you murder Aldeath. Peaceful solution. I mean, I'm not really looking for a peaceful solution. I think if we have Jahira, then the peaceful solution does enable them to just walk away. You can actually negotiate a peaceful solution, which still gives you the good outcome with the rich guy. But here we're just gonna murder them, because who cares? I will listen for now. Um... Elminster this, Elminster that. Give me 2,000 years and the pointy hat Forward? and I'll kick his arse. I guess sleep actually is a penalty to saving throw, doesn't it? Hang on, horror is just save as is, spell versus save versus spell. And sleep gives them a minus three, as long as they're vulnerable. Please don't disturb me while I plot to overthrow you. Okay, these are just generic druids. I'm gonna go ahead and just use a sleep. They're probably low enough level that's gonna help. We'll see if we can knock down Seniad over here. All right, no one fell down. They continue under the delusion that I care at all. So change of plans. Let's go back to horror. What the? Is that the horror effect? Oh, they were flame blading themselves at the same time as they fell over from, I don't know, now I'm confused. They're not feared. Maybe they did fall asleep, but 
It took a while? I don't know. Alright, give you the gratitude for the aid you've given us. If you ever travel to Baldur's Gate, come to the Merchant's League Estate. I will aid you in any way I can. Now take this small token of my appreciation. So yeah, by um, siding with him, um, not only do you, um, you... You gain access to this whole building that you don't normally gain access to. And if you do kill him, someone does try to murder you in town. Although presumably you still get some XP from that. I like how they come in here and then like... Wait, where are they? Like, how does this happen? Um, I mean, it might be worth... Again, you disturb me. Checking this box. What's in the box? Oh, stuff's in the box. What's yeah, hello? Come over here. Arrows, arrows, arrows. Potions, potions. Gems. What is this ring? Druid's ring. Charm animal. Yeah, okay. We'll just throw it in the gem bag and sell it. We're not going to do that, but it is quite interesting. Okay, I think that's all there is of interest on this map. So we'll just depart. Oh, Dread Wolf. Not so dreadful wolf. How may I be of assistance? Yeah, I'll go back to our Skona here. We do do good damage with it. In these open areas, we're not going to get choke pointed. And again, Kill finally has enough hit points to not be crap. Minus 3 AC is pretty good as well. Yeah, I don't like these non-negative ACs over here, but... Space and be gone. At least we're going to get a robe of the evil Archmage after we die. Hey, how much XP does my wrecked. main character have? Okay. So, we are Speak 600 HP away. I'm... Hang on, is that being subdivided? Yeah, so I have... I have more than 10,000 XP I total. For now. You are so irritating. Maybe I can get bail off. Yeah, I guess we should try. Huh. I'm gonna go to Larswood. You have been waylaid by enemies waited and by must defend caps. yourself. Not ideal, but what? I think it'll it be okay. Now? They're not gonna be vulnerable to most shit we throw at them. Like, I don't think we can disable them with sleep and stuff, although I keep being surprised. Fucking Eldoth, man. Let's try that again. Okay, not waylaid. Uh, a bunch of bandits. Oh, we don't even need your scalps. I'm so bitter that I missed that whole thing. I was, maybe I was being too optimal in places. Not doing redundant trips and therefore not triggering things. And they're still worth 25 each. And they do stack to like 10, so you get 250 gold per Speak stack. And be gone. Which isn't the worst, I guess. You're so dumb. Yeah, that is a lot of bandit scalps, but I, will listen I guess that was now. a lot of bandits. Alright. I don't even know how much more money we need for things. Like, I don't know what our shopping list is at this point. Yeah, normally I'd be looking to buy a Robo the Archmiger or two, and I thought I was going to be doing it again this time. I won't bother with the scalps anymore. Yeah, maybe I won't care about them. We shall hold here. You look tired. Oh, that's right, we got interrupted! I think it would be well to stop and rest. Okay. What's Please? your worry? Uh, Again you disturb me. Uh, Space and be gone. Okay. Over here where we find Bela? Oh, there we go. Brump. I've never seen this. It's about time you came through for me. I was beginning to wonder whether your incompetence was... Wait. You fool! I am not fully revived! I am diminished, damaged, and dangerously deteriorated! Why, 
I've even lost some of my purse <laughs> Um, So there is the um, the extra DLC, the Black Pits or whatever, and Baloth is like the guy who's, you know, that, that's your main contact, that's the guy kind of running the show here. Um, but yeah, he shows up as a uh, NPC here in Extended Edition. If you come here with a particular amount of XP. Najim? Are you even listening? My most and Najim is his jinn. Friend. <coughs> Where are you? Surely you aren't going to leave me up here. Ah, you conniving. Up here on the surface, as opposed I to under dark. your realm wide open and drag you into this plane of. Yo. Hello. Well, this is awkward. <laughs> Who the hell are you? How can I forget? Allow me to introduce myself. I am Bayloth Baratil, more commonly known as Bayloth the Entertainer. Yes, I know, that Bayloth. Fall to your knees and beg for mercy. I'm sure you know the drill. I shall do no such thing. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, cool, Viconia has some stuff. Stay, stay your hand a moment, Quill. Drow do not typically leave the Underdark for of their own accord. And I do not wish to see one of my kind slain without good reason. Oh, I like this one. Check your tongue, male. Clearly you do not know what I consider to be good reason. But of course, Slender One. Anything for a lady of such grace. What house did you say you were from again? Please, don't say to word. <laughs> House Dwarden, the depths of their treachery cannot even begin to! <clears throat> Ahem. Consider your hand unstayed, Quill. <laughs> oh my, tough crowd. In any case, it seems that I am in a bit of a bind. I am unable to return to my home, and I am bare to the boundless barbarism of the surface world. That's a shame, nice guy like you mixed up in a situation like this. You must be crawling with questions, but first, let me elucidate recent events. Perhaps many of your petty ponderances will be answered. Perhaps they will be. Carry on. My most recent project was a little something I called the Black Pit. See? Told you. I'm sure you've heard of it. Mortal pitted against mortal in a desperate bid to... Oh, it doesn't matter anymore. Uh, I pretty good bank houses. Can't say I have. You must be out of the loop. It was a marvelous sight. The roaring crowd, my obedient gin slave keeping the prisoners in line, the sound of hammer crushing bone. Oh, such fond memories. Wait, how'd you get the gin in the first place? A favor here, a clever spell there, a geese or two. It's not so hard. And it worked out so well for you. Things went quite swimmingly until some upstarts tricked me into facing them in battle. They cheated, of course. Is that how the Black Pits ends? I've never done it. I like I did like the first 10 minutes. But I am nothing if not calculatingly cautious. And so I instructed that Jin jerk Najim to grant me a final wish that I be protected from death. Oh, he granted that one all right. As you can see, I live again. No demon web pits for me. But I am bereft of my previous power, forced to converse with a pack of mouth breed. Oh. I apologize. I'm beginning to ramble. <sighs> I've been called worse by better. In any case, I feel a request coming. I am simply unaccustomed to dealing with your kind on less than crushingly advantageous terms. <laughs> I'll try to speak lowly and in reverent terms. I do not make it a habit to beg others for aid, and I prefer to lend favors rather than request them. Well, now I definitely feel a request coming. Clearly, I still command some of my powers. Even in this diminished state, I must remain one of the top five spellcasters in all the realms. If someone were to offer me martial protection, I'm sure I could be of great help to whatever it is you're doing. There it is. Fine, whatever. Welcome aboard. Excuse me if I chortle drow. I doubt you would rank within top five spellcasters within your own bed. And it's true. I'm shockingly popular with sorcerous women. <laughs> Who voices this guy? What? That quick wit will last you only so long, Dark One. If we elect to bring him with us, I shall see that I'm rewarded handsomely for his head. So I can really come with you? How perspicacious of you. You won't regret this. Now then, I assume you'll want me in a leadership capacity? <laughs> um, I don't know if, like, if, if both of them lead to exactly the same thing or what, but back to the line, Drow. Yeah, just now, write down your suggestions and then choke on them. Very crass. <laughs> Fine, then. Lead onward. What is this going to look like here? I clearly have to park someone. If 
for at least a moment. Okay, let's park Eldoff. I'm going to be charming. Perhaps we'll meet again. Okay, you're, you're going to chill here, right? For now. Okay. So, Robe of the Evil Archmage. This thing is amazingly good. Gives you base, sets your base AC to 5, plus 1 to all saves, 50% magic resistance. It's amazing. It's the real reason that we were wanting to come here. Uh, speedily stolen sleeve, slave salve. Oh, it's a healing potion. Okay. And then, yeah, you've got uh, Baratil's Burden. Created by a genie as a gift to the drow sword for Baloth Baratil. The subsidian ring with blood red ruby almost hypnotically drives the eye to it. Acting as additional storage space for magical knowledge, once placed upon a spellcaster's finger, it imbues him with the ability to learn additional spells beyond what a skill normally allows, and gives the wearer the chance to spontaneously create wealth once a day in the form of some gemstone. But that is a double-edged sword. Should the gem fail to materialize, the wearer wear endures a period of searing pain. Jin that created the ring, not entirely trusting person to whom it was gifted, wove a curse into the black bland stone ban. In battle with a Jin, the ring's wearer will find himself in extreme disadvantage. Once donned, it cannot be removed from wearer's finger, no matter how much you might wish it so. So yeah, additional spells for sorcerers. Huge penalty to combat versus genies, which is weirdly specific and I don't think is relevant at all in Baldur's Gate 1. I can't think of a genie in Baldur's Gate 1. I might be wrong. And yeah, can uh, create Peter a random gem. Eh? What do you want? Or damage. Shire looks upon us with favor. Let him drained. Is there really no one else you can bother? I guess you have to rest for the Speak day. Speak and be gone. Um. Okay, let's look at his spells. So as a sorcerer, Beeloth works very different. Doesn't memorize spells. He can. Uh, so first level spells, he's got six casting. He can cast the same spell six times, six different spells, whatever he wants, just on the fly every single day. He's also got Identify built in, which is very convenient. Do we just drop Edwin? I mean, in Baldur's Gate 2, you want all all spellcasters all the time. It's less relevant in Baldur's Gate 1, but still. I can't. We can't drop Edwin. Shield Spook. Detect Invis. Mirror Image ready to go. Fireball has got haste. Great party buff. I mean, no, Baylos is too good. He's got pretty good stats as well. Right? It, 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 he'd be a little tankier if his dexterity was higher, but he's not bad. He's got a dex of five, or an AC of five right now because of the robes of the evil archmage, which could be better overall. Um, huh. So we got to get the stuff off Eldoth, including removing the Curse Ring. Do I give that to Baloth? I mean, he's got good hit points. So yeah, he would he would take max of suffering. He'd lose two uh, hit points per level. I mean, maybe I just shouldn't have bought the ring at all if I was going to keep Baloth. I was <sighs> okay. Here's my plan. We're going to use Eldoth. Do we even bother finishing this personal quest? I really don't give a shit about Eldoth, actually. Can I just, can I just murder him and we'll drop his stuff? Would that be simple? Is that the simplest way what to get, get all my stuff Sarah? sorted? I will listen power. for now. Nothing personal, kid. Okay. Well done. I mean, you know, that was, that was a great source of uh, easy identifications. But there we go. All right. So I still have this claw. Do I throw it on Dorn? I'm really tempted. Since he doesn't lose any hit points, it is unfortunate that his save versus poison is going to suck. I think, I think we just try it. Uh, right now, yeah, the 8, which is pretty good. Well, I mean, it's not the worst. Especially if we can get him other things that improves his saving throws. Okay, let's just do it. Uh, Mail the dead, yeah. No one good there. Legacy of the master. Um, Dark, is that your skill? Quarter staff and dark. Well, we're going to want you to be kitted out on dark just so you don't run into melee. Hell, I'm tempted to just throw a sling on him. Even if he's not um, proficient in it. Oh, did we lose two more rep when this guy joined? Because he's a drow? Yep. Not a 
Mr. Clone, though. Oh, uh, I guess, yeah, these things all went to my main character here. But, I'll throw them on Bailoff. Okay, yeah, again, I think that's, like, that's actually a confusion thing, so we're not gonna grab that. Put all the containers here, because it'll be convenient to give him stuff, because he can, he'll ID it with spells rather than lore. But that's gonna be alright. Hmm... Let's do it. Investing a lot in Dorn, but that's gonna be okay, and yeah. Oh yeah, all these poison arrows! Oh, which can't be used by anyone anymore. Okay. So no one can use the Mail of the Dead. But I will try to keep, um, Baylos inventory clear, because yeah, we'll get him to, um, be looting things. So that he can ID and whatnot. I will listen. All right, I think now. I'm fine with that, folks. We're gonna put a cut in here with our new party. Well, this is a long video, uh, but we got a new party member, and this will be our final party member. Um, Eldoth sucked. I'm fine with seeing the back of him. That's gonna be okay. Uh, I did this three mages in a row, although I'm barely a mage, mostly just playing as an archer. But that was a pretty good group. Yeah, comes in level six, all the time. And you, we could have gotten him earlier, and then we would have had his power a lot sooner in here, which would have been great. Eh? What do you want? Uh, let's put in... Magic missiles, a quick, quick cast, ready to go. Probably acid arrow is another convenient, ready to go thing here. Okay. Folks, thanks a lot for watching. I'm going to see you guys next time. Bye-bye.